Hey, it's Alan. Welcome back. All right, this course is mostly about Blazor and Dapper. Blazor is just part of the whole Visual Studio .NET thing, but Dapper is a third-party package, so we'll have to bring that into the project we're working on in order to use it. We can do that in Visual Studio by opening Visual Studio and then the project. And then when the project is open, you want to right-click the solution name and choose Manage New Get Packages for Solution. To get started in here, you want to click Browse to look for packages, and NuGet.org is your source. Then in the search box, go ahead and type Dapper, D-A-P-P-E-R. There'll be a bunch of them, but you're looking for this one by Sam Saffron at all, 32 million downloads. That's the one. Click that. Click this checkbox. Click Install and just follow the on-screen instructions saying OK or Yes or whatever they ask. And then we're also going to grab um, another one called Microsoft.data.sql client, which is kind of a newer version of the system.data.sql client. This is the one right here we want, Microsoft. System.data.sql client you actually probably have already. You want to grab this Microsoft.data.sql client, and you can read about that online if you want to learn more. But um, just go ahead and click it and install it. And again, you'll go through this little bit. And uh, that's it for uh, packages, for NuGet packages. So uh, we can clear that out, go to installed, and now it says I have two installed Dapper and Microsoft Data.sql client. You can close that tab like any other with this little X. And now if you come over here and expand out dependencies and packages, you'll see those are now part of this project. Okay, and you don't have to do anything else with them except calling them when needed. All right, and you'll see how to do that later. All right, so our packages are ready to go. Let's move on.